All right, guys, you have a lot to choose from for this answer. I want to know what the Cleveland Browns' favorite pick was for you, Chris Fedor. How about the first one? First one. Corey Coleman. They went in this draft needing guys who could score touchdowns. 20 touchdowns at Baylor. I know he's a raw route runner. I know he had 10 drops. But big plays change the complexion of the game. And if you don't have a great quarterback, put weapons around him, make things easier for him. Corey Coleman. think he's got a chance to Michael. be the number one. Since Fido went on the offensive side of the ball, I'll go the defensive side of the ball. I, I really like the Emmanuel Agba selection. I think, uh, you know, the kid's got a chance to be a difference maker in putting pressure on the quarterback. And as we know, last year, what, 25 sacks, very worst <laughs> in the National Football League. So, I mean, it's definitive what he's got to do. Can he come into the NFL and have it translate from uh, how he performed in college? I think it's a possibility, yeah, as his career goes along. I like Agba. But Shaw, say Scooby right. Do it. <laughs> Scooby. Scooby right. No. Uh, I'm going to go with Chris on this one. I, I, I think that uh, th this organization for too long has tried to uh, mix and match quarterbacks, but also hasn't supported those quarterbacks with weapons. And I think doing this early will benefit either RG3 or Cody Kessler or one of the 17 other quarterbacks. <laughs> uh, Let's rank right. them. You tell us who's your favorite. <laughs>